In recent years, software-defined networking, or SDN, has emerged as the next big thing in the networking industry. Given all the hype, where are we now? Researchers at Stanford are credited with creating the idea of bringing the tenets of virtualization to networking, and thus creating the software-defined networking market. Traditional networking uses integrated hardware and software to direct traffic across a series of routers and switches. The original use case for SDN was to virtualize the network by separating the control plane that manages the network from the data plane where traffic flows. There is a smart controller running specialized software that manages all network traffic in the data center, and a series of routers and switches that forward packets of traffic. Virtualizing the network comes with advantages. Networks can be spun up and down dynamically, they can be fine-tuned for specific application use cases, and security policies can be installed on each individual network. Today, the SDN market has evolved, and it's breaking out of the data center. SDN is being used in the wide area network to control how enterprises connect to their branch offices. This use case, called SD-WAN, uses software to aggregate multiple types of network connections such as broadband, MPLS, or wireless to create strong and cost-effective connections. Micro-segmentation is the idea of using SDN for security. Certain networks can be ultra-secure and carry sensitive data. Other networks can be public-facing. So, if a hacker gets into a public-facing web server, they are restricted to the server segment of the network. This limits the hacker's ability to access any other segments such as secure data center networks. SDN is also used in an area called Network Function Virtualization, or NFV. This is the idea of replacing specialized hardware like firewalls and load balancers with software running on off-the-shelf server hardware. Some vendors are using SDN to connect data centers to public cloud providers, creating a hybrid cloud network that includes micro-segmentation or dynamic scaling abilities. Other SDNs could be used to help manage the deluge of traffic from the Internet of Things, segmenting network traffic and helping to organize the data. SDN has evolved from a specific use case to being applied to many different areas of networking, both within the data center, out to the cloud, and in the new world of IoT. As software is used to control the network, it becomes more agile, easier to manage, and it's ready to adapt to whatever use cases emerge in the future.